All right, another delicious breakfast option. But we all know breakfast can be e eaten at any time of day. That smoothie recipe we just showed you um, makes a great lunch, makes a great snack. Can even have it for dinner if you uh, did, if you skip the smoothie in the morning and had something else. So this is my version on oatmeal. I I personally like my oats cold. So I'd start with some oats, rolled organic oats. And then I have a trail mix that I like from the store that has a variety of nuts and seeds and some sultanas. Put a little bit of a trail mix in there. Um, a little scoop of fresh peanut butter. Boom. A little bit of jam. I need another spoon. A little bit of an organic jam. This one's a mixed berry. And then, I really like banana. Maybe you want to put some pear or apple or a different fruit in there. Maybe a few slices of orange. Um, but with the oats, the trail mix, the banana, the peanut butter, the jam. This is how I like my little bowl. Um, I took this out to, this is what I would make in, in Joshua Tree if I was camping. Um, and then the best thing is you can add a couple things. You can add a little bit of oat milk because it will soften those oats and you're just eating it as like a cold breakfast cereal. Or you can even add um, the smoothie that we just showed you how to make that one too. So you either use the smoothie as the milk, use some oat milk, almond milk. Um, and this is one I actually prepared earlier in a mason jar to go so I can eat it after surfing or climbing, after soccer practice, whatever. And this is what you could have for breakfast, lunch, or dinner anytime. All right, give it a try. Let me know whether you prefer it hot or cold. My preference is cold and it makes it quicker to eat. All right, have a good day, bye.